Just another really quick video on um, how to set up cross band repeat on the Kenwood uh, TMD710G or any of the other uh, 710s to be honest with you. Um, I've set up two frequencies here 145 um, 325 and uh, 433 uh, decimal 325 um, and I've named them cross band 1 and cross band 2. Um, and the idea here is that uh, I could have um, another radar amateur who I am um, friendly with, or, or at least someone that knows uh, that I'm out and about, uh, monitoring on either of these two frequencies. Um, and I would perhaps presume that he's monitoring on the two meter frequency. Um, and uh, I am on my handset, uh, which is in close proximity to my car, but I'm not in my car. I'm out and about perhaps climbing um, or walking through um, a bit of forest or whatever. Uh, and my handy is not able to uh, to communicate with my, my colleague on, uh, you know, on 145.325. So the idea here is that you would set your um, radio up in the car as the, the repeater, the go-between. Um, so this is what I'm going to show you you can do. So you would set the uh, two meter frequency in the, the band A and the uh, the UHF um, frequency, the 70 centimeter frequency in band B. Uh, you turn the radio off, you hold down the third button in and then turn the radio back on again. Wait a few seconds and uh, you're in cross band mode, hopefully. Doesn't look like I've managed to do it. Just bear with me a second. I may have been able to. I'm not so sure. No, I haven't. Bear with. There I am. So I'm in cross-band mode now. Now, the great bit here is that if I use my... This is a small little Bofang, which I've uh, programmed for the, the uh, UHF frequencies. And I have my other radio, which is another Kenwood, which I've programmed for the two meter frequencies. So bear with me a second and let me just uh, step outside the car. I should put them on the roof. So let me just key up with this one. Um, so I'll key up on um, 433. On, uh, this, by the way, is on half a watt. Um, here we go. And you can see I was receiving that signal. M0 MSN testing. I was receiving that on uh, 145. Now, if I key up on 145. M0 MSN testing. As you can see, I'm now receiving that on 433. So there you go. Uh, how to use cross um, band repeat on your uh, on your mobile. It can also be done on the uh, on the base station. So let's show you that now. To do it from the TS2000, you would select the cross channel repeater mode. Uh, you go into the sub. You would select your um, cross bands so I've in this particular case I've done 144 850 on one and one and 433 400 on on the other uh, this is purely for demonstration purposes and I hasten to add um, that there's a dummy load on the back of this uh, radio um, and uh, on the handies I've turned the power down to about 100 milliwatts uh, so um, if if this is illegal or in the UK, then I'm hopefully not breaking any rules. Uh, but, you know, we're trying to demonstrate a, um, a functionality here for, for any of you to play with. So so we would go into, um, where are we? Into repeater mode, hit the sub button, um, select... Um, the the repeater hold over, which means that when you transmit um, and finish your finish your um, your transmission, it will continue to transmit for about two or three seconds before dropping the carrier. Um, so that's been switched on. Um, what else do we need? 
okay so the next one is if we wanted to we could put a um, a, a DCS code in to uh, the transmission so that it wouldn't key up for anyone else unless they have the same code um, and we also have an acknowledgement on which means that at the end of the transmission it would give us a tone or uh, in this case oh, I've got my uh, my handheld receiving the Gloucester repeater so in this case it would um, give us a, a pip or, or um, at least an acknowledgement um, and we are not going to remote control this we can remote control it if we put it into remote control you would have to initiate the um, the band uh, or the repeater anyway let's turn it on and we've now got it in cross mode and we're on so here's my handy okay and if you notice if i transmit on this it's on 144850 and retransmitting it on uh, 433400 uh, and the same can be said when I transmit on 433400 it retransmit on um, 144800 can we get that into focus So, it's brilliant, absolutely brilliant.